Greetings, my friends. Today, we have something different, but the same. Kit Kats. 3D cereal. And key lime pie. All right, let's get these on a plate. Okay. Guess which one of these is fruity cereal? And guess which one is key lime pie? Let us know in the comments below. If you are correct, you'll win a prize. That prize will be a pat on the back, which you must administer yourself. All right, which one of these should we try first? I think we'll go for this one. All right, what's it going to be? That's the fruity cereal. Tastes like uh, fruity cereal. And that's the key lime pie. And I'm surprised. I like the key lime pie one better. I was expecting like the fruity cereal. Let's do something dangerous. Probably the first time on YouTube. That's even better. Oh, wait a minute. I think I gotta lie down. too sure what happens is there. Anyway, here I am with half a dozen Kit Kats. And you know, as I said earlier, I really don't care for key lime pie. I guess this is a sign that this key lime pie doesn't really taste much like key lime pie. And the fruity cereal, well it's just, you know, vaguely Fruity cereal tasting. Not anyone in particular. I don't know how much different all those things really taste from each other. I guess they either couldn't get or didn't want to pay for a license. Nestle owns Cheerios. So where's the Cheerios flavored Kit Kats? Perhaps in Japan. I understand that they have a few exclusive flavors of Kit Kat over there. But then Kit Kat is made by Hershey in the United States. And they have a couple cereals with General Mills. And this stuff is just too confusing. But you know, why should I have to wait for Kit Kat? I can make my own flavors. To the laboratory. Kit Kat experimental flavors number one. Graham cracker. Oh. 
That's actually pretty good. He has a higher ratio of graham cracker, though. Somewhere in between A and B would be optimal. Kit Kat Experimental Flavor Number Two. Tootsie Fruit Shoes. <sighs> Gotta pick one, I guess. Uh, lemons probably why no vanilla probably not good either. why is this color vanilla this color looks more suitable for vanilla well anyway I'll do orange And the orange is overpowering. And that also works pretty good. Who would have guessed orange goes with chocolate? Kit Kat Experimental Flavor Number 3. Note that we've had to switch to the full-size Kit Kats, as I have run out of the snack size. Knott's Berry Farm Boysenberry Shortbread Cookies. This is the best one yet. Big surprise. Boysenberry improves the flavor of everything. Except for maybe pizza. Kit Kat experimental flavor number four. Marvel's The Avengers Wrigley's Five Gum Spearmint Rain. Yes, I am that reckless. Surprisingly good. I have to remember not to swallow this. Kit Kat Experimental Flavors number five. Dunkaroos. Oh man, that frosting is just too much. Kit Kat. Experimental flavor number six. Swedish fish. Yep. Nope. This one's a fail. Well, I think that'll do it for today. So whether you prefer key lime pie, 
of fruity cereal. If that fruity cereal you like is fruity pebbles or fruit loops or tricks or even moonstones. Or if you just like the regular Kit Kats. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, comment, and ring the notification bell to stay up to date with my latest Kit Kat videos. Okay, well this is my last Dunkaroos, so we got to go out in style. I know I said before, never go full 90s, so we're going to give it one last shot. I got my rollerblades on. I got my flannel shirt that hasn't been washed since it was new. My Nirvana t-shirt with the little round face and the X'd out eyes and the squiggly mouth. And I got my baseball cap on backwards. Here we go. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Never go full 90s.